Hi everyone, I'm Mr. Mayor and welcome to PESN Studios. Today we're covering the Backyard Olympics. The Backyard Olympics today are featuring ladder ball, bocce ball, cornhole, and horseshoe pitching. The major skill being used is the underhand roll. For a closer look, let's head out to the backyard with Mr. Mayor. Thanks, Mr. Mayor. We're out here just moments before opening ceremonies of the Backyard Olympics. As you take a stroll with me, you can see the layout of the land. Over here, we have ladder ball for our first event, followed up by cornhole. And as we take a stroll down near the trampoline, over here, we have horseshoes set up. And for the last event of the Backyard Olympics, we have our Polino and our bocce ball set up for a game of bocce ball. First off, Mr. Mayor, I'd like to say thanks for dressing up. You're looking very dapper in your shirt and tie out there. Thanks, Mr. Mayor. I like to keep it classy. Now, my understanding that the featured skill in the Backyard Olympics is the underhand roll. Can you take us through this a little bit more, Mr. Mayor? Absolutely, Mr. Mayor. The featured skill today is the underhand throw or roll. To do this skill correctly, you want to step with your opposite foot of your throwing hand. I'm right-handed, so I'm going to step with my left foot. I'm going to step straight, bring it back straight, and follow through straight. Now, the follow through and the rate of speed all depends on the object you're throwing and the target you're throwing at. Step straight, bring it back straight, follow through straight. Or if you're using a bola, which is used in the game of ladder ball, or a horseshoe used in the game of horseshoe pitching. And lastly, if you're using a bocce ball, trying to get it, rolling it closest to the polino in the game of bocce ball. Fantastic, Mr. Mayor. I must say your form is looking excellent. Now, understanding not everybody's backyard is the same, nor does everybody have the same equipment. Are, is there any resource out there to help people at home with some adjustments for their backyard Olympic games? I'm so glad you asked that, Mr. Mayor. For more information, please visit MrMayorsPhysEdPage.com. Then click on the sports unit, tab down to the backyard Olympics, and here you'll have all kinds of information on cornhole and some adjustments how to play in the backyard. You'll also have information on ladder ball and how to play that as well and make some adjustments. Horseshoe pitching and finally bocce ball and how to play that and make adjustments in the backyard. Thanks again Mr. Mayor. During these games I anticipate sportsmanship plays a major factor in people having fun in the backyard. Do you find this to be true? Wow, amazing, Mr. Mayor. I was just about to bring up sportsmanship. It's like you and I are the same person. We're really vibing today. Sportsmanship plays a vital role in the backyard games. To make sure that everybody's having a good time, please visit MrMayorsPhysEdPage.com. Click on the home button, then click on sportsmanship. From there, you can see Mr. Mayor's sportsmanship checklist. I play by the rules of the game. I always play fair. I follow the directions of the coach or referee. I respect my opponent's effort. I encourage my teammates. My favorite one is, I try to avoid arguments by explaining the rules of the game instead of making accusations. And finally, I shake hands or offer congratulations to my opponents after a game or match. That's some great advice on sportsmanship. And I'm now just getting word that opening ceremonies are about to begin. Yes, we're very excited. Opening ceremonies is about to get started. a fantastic day out there for the Backyard Olympics. Thanks for your hard work, Mr. Mayor. 
Signing off from PESN Studios. Yours in kindness, health, and physical education. I'm Mr. Mayor.